You sit down, Mr. Carroll. Thank you, sir. Now, what can I do for you, Mr. Cairo? May a strange offer condolences for your partner's unfortunate death. Thanks. It seems to speed I'm trying to recover ornament that, uh, shall we say, has been mislaid. Uh -huh. I thought and hoped you could assist me. The ornament uh, is a statue, a black figure of a bird. I am prepared to pay on behalf of the figure's rightful owner the sum of $5,000 for its recovery. I am prepared to promise to do it, but it's a phrase and no questions will be asked. $5,000 is a lot of money. Yes, Abby? No, that'll be all. Just be sure to lock the door behind you on your way out. Good night. Five thousand dollars. You will clasp your hands together at the back of your neck. I intend to search your offices, Mr. Spade. I warn you, if you attempt to prevent me, I shall certainly shoot you. Go ahead and search. Will you please come to the center of the room? I have to make certain that you're not armed. Sorry. Right. Imagine my embarrassment when I found out that $5,000 offer was just too weak. Mr. Spade, my offer is generous. I am prepared to pay $5,000 for the figure's return. You have it? No. But if it isn't here, why did you risk serious injury to prevent my searching for Why don't you sit around here and let people come in and stick me up? Staying at the Hotel Belvedere, room 635. I sincerely expect the greatest mutual benefit from our association, Mr. Spade. Oh, may I please have my gun now? Oh, sure, I've forgotten all about it. Will you please clasp your hands together at the back of your neck? I intend to search your offices. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> go, go, go ahead. I won't stop you.